This is a video that people have asked me to watch. Is this it right here? All Final Fantasy mounts and how to get them, is this it? Okay, here we go. Hey Buns, today I'm taking on the mountainous task of showing you how to get every single mount in Final Fantasy XIV. Jesus Remember Christ. that to mount up at all, you'll need to have done the quest My Little Chocobo at level 20. My Little Chocobo? And that's after you pick a grand company. If um, you see this symbol, my it means the mount chocobo. is tradable, so you might be able to find it on the market board. If a mount is an achievement reward, you'll need to pick it up from Jonathas near Apkalu Falls oh in God. Gridania. Adam, I'll you. also talk about mounts that are no longer obtainable at the end of this video. All right. First up, Gold Saucer. Here you'll play mini games to get a special currency called MGP, what which you this? can trade for mounts and other loot. Here are the various mounts and their costs. Okay. Wait, holy shit, that's cool. That's a big boy. So you can get... Wait, what the fuck? Wait, this is a mount? How do you ride her? Oh, never mind. Oh, man. I thought the girl was the mount. Man, that's some... Man, dude. Bro, that's a... That's fucked. They had to play me like that? Okay. Okay. What the fuck? Oh, that's cool. That looks like the monsters in Doom. What the fuck? Those are actually badass. What the hell is this? this gets Cactus Jack. Holy shit, this is actually... Wait, and you're on his shoulder? You can ride this around? What the hell? It's a Cactar? Next up, okay. PvP. Now, as long as you are above level 30, you are good okay. to PvP. Everybody's stats and HP are equalized, great. so gear and levels beyond Amazing. 30 don't matter. PvP is a great way to get mounts, such as the Aerodynamics system. This comes from winning 100 Fields of Glory frontline PvP what matches to get the achievement in a Blaze of Glory 5. Next, you can get the Gloria class airship by winning 200 matches. How's that? That's not an airship. That's an that that's like an air like a little baby baby airplane. What is? How is this an? What is this an airplane for ants? Look at it. They're so small. It's a hover. Yeah, this is a little hoverboard. What the hell is this? Of the feast. The logistics system mount is awarded when you win two. Okay, thank. I'm so happy to see this. So it's not just Blizzard that does re recolors. This is literally a recolor of the blue one. So it's it's not just it's not just Blizzard. Everybody does it. Yes, Final Fantasy does it too. You've got the the blue star and you've got the death star. Frontline matches with the same grand company. Yeah. Magitech Avenger is from winning Rival Wings 100 times. Wow. Magic That's actually cool. Avenger A1 is obtained by winning Hidden Gorge 100 times. Okay. Magitech Sky Armor costs 20,000 wolf marks from the Storm Sergeant That's Wolves cool. Den Provisioner at the Wolves Den Pier. That is really You cool. can get wolf marks just by participating in PvP. The Safeguard okay. System is obtained by winning 100 frontline matches. That's the Serpent a lot. War Steed is from winning 100 frontline matches with Order of the Twin Adder. That one sucks. For the Storm War Steed, this, you'll need to win 100 sucks. frontline matches this with sucks. the Maelstrom. For the Flame War Steed, this you'll need to win 100 sucks. frontline like matches it. with the Immortal Flames. And for Construct 7, you'll need to win 100 Ansal Haker matches. And I just want to add that in the course of me making this video and getting all the footage that I needed of the different PvP mounts, um, all of the people that I met from the PvP. Wait, it is like Gmod. This actually is just like Gmod. What the fuck? I, I think Gmod looks way cooler than that one, okay? I'm gonna be honest. I think Gmod looks way fucking cooler. However, um, it's a hundred victories. I'd have to farm the shit out of that one. You can get this mount? Yeah. It's extremely nice. It's not a 1% chance, you're right. way out of their way right. to help me find the mounts that I needed to record, and they were just super cool overall. They told me to send people over to the PV Paisa Discord server, which is like the balance, but for PvP. Okay, and who knows, cool. with a bit of guidance from them, you might rank top 100 and get yourself a Manisha's mount. Those mounts will be released to the top 100 players per data center after the current season ends and will not be obtainable after that.
The Mentor Roulette is a special duty roulette that you'll unlock by being a PvE mentor and completing every dungeon trial, guild hust, and raid. That so they have the mentor system in Final Fantasy. Did, wait, did WoW take this from Final Fantasy? Damn. Well, they should have done it better because, like, the, the WoW version sucks. Here's in Mentor Roulette. I'll put a complete list of the content you need to complete to unlock Mentor yeah. Roulette. Uh, but if you do it 2,000 times, then you will get the Astro to see Holy her. shit! It's a unicorn. It's a fucking unicorn, dude. What the hell? That's crazy. Is it? It's a. It's a Pegasus unicorn. Pegasus. It looks pretty great. Yeah. But I asked the person who was posing for this how long it took them to get the Astro, and they said they did mentor roulette all day, every day for a year. So you better strope in for a grind. Every tank can get a basic mount and an armored version of it. So for warrior. So I want to say right here. If you look at tanking classes, every tank these are for alpha males, okay? And so you look at the, these are the alpha male classes. Tanks are obviously the alpha male class. These are the coolest mounts. You have, I mean, look at that tiger. Look at the saber tooth tiger. He, this guy, he's on steroids. Like this, this the, the tiger works out. It's not just the guy, the tiger does too. Look at that bear. Look at that fucking, what even is that? That's like a like a, a fucking legendary Pokemon at the bottom right. It can get a basic mount Holy and an armored version of it. So for what warrior, the there's fuck? the war bear and battle bear. That's the badass. Paladin, war lion and battle lion. The dark knight, the war panther and battle panther. Wait, that was the one I was gonna play. Was dark knight, wasn't it? Because it, that's the one that has like the big sword. The can it fly? Can that mount fly? Yes. Holy shit. All mounts fly? How the fuck is this gonna fly? Please explain to me how this flies. Because it couldn't even evolve enough to stay alive until whenever we're here. Oh, it's magic. Gunbreaker, the War Tiger, and Battle okay. Tiger. Damn, now, that's Warrior, badass. Paladin, and Dark Knight's first mount. The ones with achievements that say high level duties I'm gonna get that. can be farmed on anything level 50 plus that's yeah. extreme or savage. I'm so, gonna get that. A solo Garuda X unsync would I, work. I, I, I will get that. The I, I don't care. mounts for those jobs and both Gunbreaker kitties, I don't though, care. will require. I, I think that the armored version sucks. I, I like the unarmored version. The unarmored version is like the last phase in a boss fight whenever he's like at full power and he's fighting for his life. This for, this is like the first part of the boss fight where like he just easy mechanics that are you know not that hard to avoid. But like nah, I I don't give a shit about that. I want to get the fucking the unarmored version. I think it looks way more badass. Higher level sixty one plus get that. content or that's, fifty sixty that's seventy so cool. roulettes or leveling roulettes. That's so bad. Why did those duty roulettes have the daily bonus it. active? So if you want to grind for the armored tank mounts or for the two saber tooth tigers. Mm -hmm. Farming Stormblood Trials Unsynced would be a pretty effective way to do that yeah. and to collect totems for dogs, which I will get to in a minute. There's the unicorn, which comes from the- This one's for girls. This is not for me. Like, can we please get back- Can we please get back to the fucking bears that are on steroids that have like five tails coming out of them and they're on fire? Like, what is this? I, I'm not- I'm not the target audience for this, okay? Level 30 Conjurer class quest, Unicorn God. Power, and the Morble, which is a reward for the True Blue achievement. Now, this is a pretty tough one, requiring that you clear turn 5 of the Binding Coil of Bahamut, turn 4 of Second Coil of Bahamut, turn 4 of Final Coil of Bahamut, Burden of the Father Savage, it's a piranha Burden plan. of the Sun Savage, and Soul of the Creator. Look at the guy's face, he's like, yeah. Yeah, bro, it is what it is, man. Yeah, bro, it is what it is. This guy's, yeah, he's cold chilling. Now, I, I think that it's not a tentacle monster, right? It's not like that. If it was, it'd be, he'd be holding the cat girl. Mage only party synced That's badass. With silence echo turned off. That's really cool. That's a cool yeah, ass it's, fucking it's mount. no joke. You'll need a dedicated group for these. And so I'm going to link some easy. Blue Mage raiding discords yeah, in easy. the description box below if you're ready to take on. <laughs> what I've been referring to on stream is Project Hentai. Good luck. And finally... Yeah, we're gonna do that. That sounds like something that I'm interested in, in doing. Uh, yeah, so we'll try that and we'll see what it is. Project Hentai. Yeah, so uh, I, I do want to announce uh, that I will be playing this game uh, quite quite soon. 
uh, turns out there's uh, some new information that's come to light that has made me uh, feel like it's a little bit more uh, more pressing for me to uh, more pressing uh, for me to uh, insert myself into this game. In the jobs category, if you get all battle jobs to level 80, you will get an Amaro mount. It's basically level until you can what say, I'm all out of- <laughs> Stupid as shit, who the fuck wants this piece of trash? Look at this stupid fucking mount. Jobs to level. Next up, <gasps> recruit a friend. So you can well, how much of an idiot you have to be to ride that stupid fucking dodo bird around? <laughs> a stupid ass fuck. That's like a scuffed chompy. I Dark Knight's not available until Heaven's Ward. Listen, bro, like, you gotta understand something. What do you think I do whenever I stop streaming? Oh, wow, you're gonna have to put 50 hours into this. Great, I can do that in two days. That's nothing. Friend to join the game by sending them your recruit a friend code. They can only redeem it after buying the game and no, within their first 50. free 30 days of playtime. What the hell? If they redeem your code and then subscribe for 90 days, yeah. after their first 30 days, you'll get a draft Chocobo okay, two-seater mount in the mail. The oh, it's a two-seater. Okay. Uh, that's kind of cool. I like that. That's all right. Do you remember that that 90 days that they pay for does not include the first or free 30 days that they got for buying the game. If you recruit one friend, you will get five gold chocobo feathers. What if your friend fuck? subscribes for 150 days, you will get five gold chocobo feathers. What the fuck? And gold chocobo feathers can be traded for mounts. So How there's many? the mana garm, which costs eight feathers. What's this? It looks like Diablo with a small head. Hey guys, I'm the Lord of Terror. It's, it's like a fucking small headed Diablo. What the fuck? I'll be right back. Bro, this is a loser mount. I don't want to look at this guy anymore. The guy looks like a fucking dumbass. Looks like a bitch. Let's look at the next one. You wash your hands? Nah, bro. Why would I wash my hands, dude? I got a clean dick. I never wash my hands because I never get my hands dirty. I never get my dick dirty either. Actually, nah, man. Actually, that doesn't... Nah, I don't mean... Nah, uh... Alright, let's watch the video. Man, shut up. Shut the fuck up. save him because it's ugly. It's stupid, <laughs> I think he's probably yeah. the ugliest mount. The two-seater amber draft this is stupid. costs eight gold feathers. I thought amber meant yellow, but it's red. I don't know why. And Twintania costs 15 gold feathers. So good luck recruiting. No fucking way. No fucking way. What the fuck? 15. Holy fuck. That's so badass. That's a lit, that's a litty mount. Gold feathers. So the good swirly luck thing recruiting. around his neck is kind of stupid, but like the yeah, that's a straight up dragon. The main story quest will award you. You know what makes me mad about WoW is like the fact that they only let you ride on drakes. It's like they're like, oh, it's a bronze drake. Oh, it's the red drake. It's the emerald drake. Bitch, I want a dragon. I want a fucking. I want a full grown, big ass motherfucker like where you're on it. I want to be like this. Where's a where's like a. I'm not fine. I, I can't find it, man. I can't find it. So I, I want to be like this. I want it to be like this. And I'm the whole mount. It's like I'm the whole mount and I'm riding and I'm the raccoon, right? And and I, I'm the dragon too. And I'm, I'm, I'm falling off. Give me a minute. But you see what I'm saying? So like it's me. Like, and that's how big it is. And like I'm on a, I'm the dragon and I'm flying around with the raccoon on my back that's actually me. But I'm a dragon. With several mounts just for playing through it. The Makes first sense. one you get is your first mount, the company Chocobo. This is you stupid. You do your Realm Reborn story quest, pick a grand company, and pay this. company seals for a Chocobo license. <laughs> this you is can decorate that... your company Chocobo with various fun Chocobo bardings. But there's wait, so they could do wait, so you were able to do the same thing that I said that WoW should do with mounts, where you have like base mounts and you can put special shit on the mount. So this literally has the thing that I want WoW to have. Only chocobos? That's fine. Can you give it a, like a, like a strap-on dick? Is there something like that you could give it on? Yes? <laughs> a lot of them, and that's kind of beyond the scope of this wow. video. The Magitek armor comes from the Realm Reborn, Wait, made to request fuck? the ultimate weapon. That's... Black Chocobo comes from the Heaven's Wait, Ward. Wait, you just don't skip Army over Born. that. Main story quest. The Does that do damage? Ultimate weapon. 
black that's pebble really comes cool from the heavens ward main story quest divine intervention that's badass. mana cutter comes from the heavens holy shit look at that ward main story quest into oh my the area. god Midgard Zormer from the Heaven's Ward main story quest, Fetters of Lament. What the fuck? And the Yule from Stormblood's main story quest in the footsteps of Bardem yeah, This the one's Brave. dumb. So just another reason for y'all Actually, no, to it's do, not. That's really to cool. <laughs> to do the main story. Damn. Deep Dungeon is one of my favorite activities in the game, and it's a great way to get some super rare amounts. Deep Dungeon's main story quest, Fetters Look of Lament. Look at that. And That's a giant ass mount. That's a Look at that. What is this? The Yol from Stormblood's main story quest in the footsteps of Bardem the Brave. Wow. So just another reason for y'all to do to do it. Oh, the Yol <laughs> is the main story. Deep Dungeon is one of my favorite activities that's in the cute. game, and it's a great way to get some super rare mounts if you are committed to it. There are two types of Deep Dungeon in the game currently. Palace of the Dead, which you can unlock from the level 17 side quest, The House That Death Built in New Gridania. Okay. You can obtain a disembodied head mount for- Wait, that's actually really cool. What the fuck? That's badass. Yeah, it's like a Dark Souls mount or some shit. 10 Galmoran pot shirts. You get one Galmoran pot shirt for clearing floor 50 of Palace of the Dead. And the pot shirts have a random chance to drop from bronze coffers anywhere in Palace of the Dead. Also in Palace of the Dead, you can get a Knight Pegasus. This one uh, honestly looks like trash. Like this actually looks like dog shit. Like I would, I would turn in currency to not have this. I would turn it, I would be like, please do not, d do not put this upon me. Do not inflict me with this illness. Do not hurt me with this thing. You can sell it. Good, I'm gonna sell it for free. This drops from gold trimmed sacks, which come from floors 151 to 200, but like you it. will need a dedicated group of the same four people, like a mini, mini static of four people to go with you from 151 to 200. It might take you a couple of days and you will probably need to read up about the monsters in there because once you die, it resets you. It's like game over. You got to start over. That's not anyway, a big have deal. Fun with you just that. don't die. Also, there's Heaven on High. That's a deep dungeon added in Stormblood that you unlock with a okay. level 61 quest knocking on Heaven's door in the Ruby Sea. Okay. The Dodo is Heaven on High's version of Night Pegasus, I suppose. What the fuck is this, dude? What the fuck is this, dude? Look at that. That's a chonker. It drops from platinum haloed sacks, which are obtained in floors <laughs> 71 through 99 of Heaven on You can these on the market board as well. Look at and those it's really the wings. same thing as before. You're going to need a, a dedicated group of four people to go in there to progress through on your save. Each oh time you God. reach floor 100, you will get an Empyrean Relic. Damn, look get at that shit. Get to floor 100 shit. four separate times and you can trade your four Empyrean Reliquaries to That's the cast badass. off Confederate NPC for four Empyrean accessories. That's Equip cool. them and talk to him again and he will give you the mount. Next up, Raid and Dungeon Drops. Now there's only one mount that drops from a dungeon. That is the Magitech Predator. It has a chance to drop from Xenos in the Alamigo Dungeon. Now so this is literally a Gmod. This mount is literally a Gmod. Straight, it is a straight up new Gmod. Oh God. Oh fucking God, dude. Ugh. All right, all right, all right. More like shred, yeah, whatever. All the rest of the mounts that I'm gonna mention in this section are raid mounts that have a 100% chance to drop. They're all guaranteed to drop. And depending on when you're watching this video after it was released, some of the raids may be easier than they are now. So- Wait a minute, so like if, if y'all said about master loot, does it drop for one person or does it drop for everybody? Okay, can you master loot that shit to yourself? Is that right? Is that right, huh? Let's see what we're gonna be able to get. I, I, I sure hope I'll, I'll, I'll get a high roll. 
I get a high roll. I can't even say it. I sure hope I get a high roll on the item. Any of these mounts unsynced recently, leave a comment saying how hard it was and how many people you needed, or if you needed to know any mechanics, just to help your fellow mount hunters with the most up-to-date information possible. That's cool. Alexander, oh, that was that one ball. What the hell is this? That's cool. Oh, look at that. It's... What the hell? That's honestly, bro, this is some fucking scuffed ass Tomic the Thomas the Tank Engine shit. Like, what is this? What is this? Uh, fucking what, uh, Arnold the, the airplane? The fucking, what does this guy even look like? This are it's cor like corky. Yeah, what the fuck? The Dark Moon Dirigible? Bro, this looks, looks like, what is this? This looks like it's straight. This is like a bad guy in a Pixar movie. He's got minions as, as pontoons. What is this, man? Not about it. That's cool. That's cool. I like that. Okay. That is bad at damn. Wait, what the? Wait, you can have other people in the mount? So you can have other people in this mount. That's a four seater mount. That's bad that damn, that's bad. At I like that. That's cool. That's really cool. Beach, thanks for hundred dollars. Thank you, man. Rama, Eden's verse. What the? So it's Zeus, but he's a centaur with wings. Wait a minute. The player isn't the nine-year-old anime girl, is it? That's me. Oh God. Okay. Wow. That is really Next cool up, though. Trial mounts and for trial mounts, unlike the raid mounts, yeah. they do not have a guaranteed chance to drop. They have a rare chance to drop from the boss itself. I'm familiar but with Every that. time you kill the boss, you get a totem, which you can eventually trade in to an item exchange NPC for the mounts. You can trade in oh. 99 totems for a mount. But okay, that's cool. It usually takes a couple of major content patches after that trial boss was released before you can actually buy the mount with totems. So with all of that said, here are the trial mounts and where they drop. Okay, let's see them. That's stupid. That's so dumb. I don't even want to look at that. That's the dumbest mount I've ever seen in my whole life. That's the dumbest. This is the second dumbest mount I've ever seen in my whole life. This is so stupid. Like, these unicorns are dumb as hell. What is this? Epona? What, what, what's it? What's this Epona shit going on? Oh, it's Vaporeon. That's great. That, yeah, these suck. Thank God. They're hard to get, apparently. Yeah, I'm glad. I'm glad. Uh, this is just, uh, they're all just recolors. All right, that's that's that that one's badass. That 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 yeah, okay. That that's that's that that one's sick. Yeah, that one's what it's about, man. That Zapdos, yeah. What the hell? This is cool. That's really cool. <laughs> With a stupid little red horn, man. Yeah, right. No, dude. Okay. The red one is cool. Yeah, I guess I'm about the red one. That's cool. Damn. Actually, that one looks really nice. What the hell? 
Yeah, what do you guys think about that one? I feel like the design on that looks really good. No, it's not just because it's purple. It's because it looks cool. What do you mean? Yeah, it looks cool, guys. Like, stop. It's not just because it's purple. But it does help that it's purple. Yeah, it, it does help. Yo, Dabim, thanks for $100. Appreciate it, man. Thank you. People are popping off. Thank you, guys. That's cool. Wait, this is like the heart of the aspects. Wait, so this is like the heart... Wait, so you don't... This is the heart of the aspects, but you don't buy it on the store? So, realistically... Realistically, just be honest with me, guys. Could I get this mount? Could I get this mount? Yes. E I could get it easy. I could get it super easy. So, do they have mounts in Final Fantasy that are, like, the mounts that, like, they look so badass and they're so cool? And they can, you got, like, 20 people can ride on the mount and, and it's, like, a fucking really cool and it, it's big and it's, like, super hard to get. Because, like, that's what I want to see. I want to see, like, the fucking, the, the mega dick mounts. Like, this one is so badass, though. This is actually really cool. Wow. This is dumb. This is dumb. This is honestly, this is so dumb. This is this is from Deviant Art. I saw this. Yeah, this is from Devi. This is from Deviant Art. Cerberus? No, it's not Cerberus. Cerberus got three fucking heads, bro. Like, what the fuck do you mean? Like, that's not Cerberus. This is just Spot. Yeah, these are dumb. That one does look cool. To be fair, that one does look cool. All right. Nope. Nope. What the fuck? Uh-uh, uh-uh. Damn. Yeah, damn, bruh. That's like a, uh, it reminds me of the Demon of Hatred in Sekiro. That's so cool, man. Small head, though, that's okay, man. That's totally okay. That's so badass. See, this mount I like a lot. This is an actual cool fucking mount. You need to get, so I have to collect all the, all the other mounts in order to get this one. So it's like the fucking Emerald Drake and the, like, Awake the Drake's achievement. In WoW, uh, that, it's the same thing. Oh, bro, that's so badass. That's so, that's so cool. I like it. Yeah. That is cool, too. This is actually really cool. What really kills it for me is the face. Look at his face. Bro, it looks like he got plastic surgery. Like, he got Botox. He's like this, dude. He like... He like... He got a face like this, dude. He got... He like, it's all the way up against his fucking face like this. That's the way it looks, man. It looks weird as hell. Innocent... This one looks stupid. Oh, that looks cool. But look at his face, man. He's got no pixels on his face. That one's cool. I like that one. That one's way cooler. That's actually badass. With, like, the effect and everything. But, like, what's so weird to me is, like, look at that character, man. That's, like, the character at the beginning of Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. This is, like, the little girl that Link talks to. And she's like, oh, sorry. I've got to... My mom wants me to plant flowers. Like, what is this, bro? Like, 
it, it's it's cute nah man it's weird like i don't want to see some fucking six-year-old anime girl riding on a dragon like th the guy that needs to be riding on a dragon needs to be like at least 250 fucking solid muscle huge beard a, a giant like fucking dragon slayer great sword just riding a gnome nah nah fuck gnomes man it's just uh, gnomes are stupid man Gnomes, I don't want gnomes in the game. Get rid of them. I don't want gnomes. Now for the beast tribe mounts. Okay. As before, I'll be separating the tribes by expansion, and I'll show where you can unlock those tribes and what reputation oh. you need to get their mount. Wait, what? I really like this mount. Wait, what the fuck? What the fuck? No way. Look at it. Dude, look how wide he is. Look how wide he is. Oh my god. That's actually cool too. I like this. Damn. Okay. Okay. This one looks kind of stupid. I don't even know what this is. What even is this? What the hell is this? What the fuck? What the fuck is this? Wait, bro, this is a dance. That's literally a dandelion. The only good thing about this mount is you get to look up her skirt. Like, that's the only good thing about... Well, oh, you're gonna literally... You're gonna fly around on a dandelion. Like, that's it. Look at this. Look at this. It's not a male mount. It glows. Yeah, of course it glows. It's a dandelion. They glow on their own. Yeah, that's the only good thing about it. That's literally the only good thing. Stripe Ray. Wait, is it, it? It's soundless. Yo, it, it's soundless. Oh my god. Look at it. What the fuck? Oh. Oh, uh, whoa, okay, all right, so the elephant is really cool, but it's Dumbo. Yeah, true. See, like, this, it, in my opinion, I think this is stupid, but I don't like how the, how, how the elephant can fly. Well, I don't care if it's a magic elephant this got helium in his in, in his horns, and so he gets to fly. I, I th it's magic. I'm just I, I just I think it, it's it, like it, it's crazy, man. You can fly around on an elephant. You fly around on an elephant, dude. How are you gonna fly around on an elephant? It's too fat. He don't have any wings. Even Dumbo doesn't Dumbo have wings? Dumbo has wings, doesn't he? He has ears. So wh where's this? Wh is he? Are he, his ears aren't even moving? He's not even flapping his ears. So that's the way the Griffins look like. And yeah, I, I I don't know about that, man. This Griffin looks weird. Look at his neck, his face. Mikosh, wait, what the hell? That's actually yeah, I like this. This is cool. It's like Xerxes in uh in 300. Yeah, yeah, a little slave mount, exactly. Okay. See, this one makes sense. Like I'm okay with this one, even though it's a pig. I I'm totally okay with this one because you can clearly see that it's using like its ears to fly, right? Like it makes sense. 
This is a, yeah, this is an actual fucking, because it, it makes sense. This is cool, even though I'm not going to be riding this shit, right? But, like, it, it, it's it's just, it's a little bit much, man. It, it is a little bit much. Yeah, pigs can fly. Horses can fly. Yeah, but they're magic, because they have, like, weird shit around them. Yeah, that's cool. What the hell? Oh, my. What the fuck? Next up, hunts. These are different world bosses that you'll need a big group to tank down. Okay. To find such a group and to know when the bosses are up, I recommend you join the Centurio Hunt Discord server. That's cool. I've got it set up to ping me anytime there's an S rank, and that's pretty cool. To unlock hunts for all expansions, you'll need to make sure you've done all the quests that I'm showing on screen now. You can pause it if you need to. And oh really, God. you shouldn't miss the opportunity to do the best named quest in the game. What is it? The Wyvern is sold for six clan mark this logs. Is stupid. You get the clan mark logs for 500 actually, Centurio seals each from Ardelaine. No, actually, I don't know. I kind of like him in a way, cause he's unique. He's like, he's like, he's like if Waluigi was a mount. In Foundation, you then trade the clan mark logs to Bertana and Idleshire. It's abstract. The Centurio but Tiger comes from killing 3,000 A cool. ranks and 2,000 S ranks. Yeah, that's badass. To get badass. the achievement, you got game. The Triceratops like is from killing 2,000 A ranks and 1,000 S Th that, ranks that's in cool. Norvrant zones. Nah, man, look at that, bro. What the fuck? Killing 2,000 A ranks and 1,000 S ranks in Norvrant zones. Bro, what the fuck? How'd he do that? How'd he do that? Magic? Nah, bro. Well, you can't use magic for everything. You can't use magic for anti gravitational tech. Nah, bro, it's not. Uh, well, how are you gonna do that? How Mount Mount's fly? What the? How are you gonna do a fly around? Well, he doesn't even, like at least give him like if you're gonna have some mount, at least give him like a jetpack on, on like his tail or something. That's what it, it just like it, I don't know it was weird to me. And forgiven reticence is purchased from Zile at the Crystarium or Ilfroy at Yulemore for three thousand two hundred <laughs> sacks of nuts. You can get your hands on some nut sacks by killing elite marks. Sort of related to hunts. Wait, she say nuts sacks? Nut sacks. Like 1,200 sacks of nuts. You can get your hands on some nut sacks. <laughs> That's good. Okay, so this mount, it, it's, it, it just, it looks like it's missing a little bit too many pixels. I'm going to be honest. That's a good, that's nuts, dude. True, dude by killing elite marks sort of related to hunts are yeah. special fates that are big bosses that appear very rarely you can also track these through the centurio hunt discord server ixion is a mount purchased with 12 ixion horns the horns are obtained from the rare fate a horse outside in the locks that's the iron bad whoa, 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 is purchased whoa, from whoa, 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 whoa. rare Wait fate a, a horse that what is this dude this mount you know what it looks like to me it's like, have you guys ever done, like, had, uh, if you ever have, like, written text in Photoshop, and then you have the different filters that you put on the text, and there's, like, the list of them, and you check every filter? That's this mount. It's got every filter on. It's the, it's the god of all unicorns. Is that right? Bro, this is the god of everything. Look at him. I don't even know what it is. It, like... Uh, it drops the, the, see the thing is this is this does look cool like to be honest this does look cool but like it's like the, the yellow shit on the horn man does he really need so he if he's a unicorn why has he got a horn like an like a reindeer he's a liger that's not real that's in napoleon dynamite man like wait no they are real never mind i learned that they are real yeah, I guess this does look cool. Horse outside in the locks. I want to see and how it the Iron around. Frog Mover is, is purchased from Fat Hard with 12 formidable cogs. It's a the robot cogs drop Pepe. From the rare fate, a finale most formidable in Colusium. That's a cool, like, Of course, the Mog piece. Station is a place where you can shop for a bunch of mounts. One way to do that is by marrying another player. You'll both need to buy the gold or platinum eternal bonding plan in the Mog Station, do the ties that bind quests, and you'll get the bird. Hopefully your partner will also give you the bird when they find out you married him just for a chicken. The rest of the Mog Station mounts are from the optional items section or from upgrading just for a chicken. 
Marry Michael. Can you? You could probably marry a dude, right? If you're a dude, you marry another dude. So, but all right. So, but what happens if they get divorced? Who gets the mount? Does the girl get them out? You both get it. No, does the girl get them out? Wait, what is it? You both get them out. You keep it? She, she takes them out and it gets. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully your partner will also give you wow. the bird when they find out you married him just for a chicken. The rest of the mock station mounts are from the optional item section or from upgrading to collector's editions. Okay. Okay, this is some fucking... Bro, this this was designed by Chris Chan. This is like... Like fucking... Nine Tails plus Pikachu. It's Sana Pikachu. <laughs> what the fuck is this? <laughs> what, what is this? I don't even know. This is so dumb. Oh my god. Oh my, oh my god, guys. She... Whoa. Look at that. That's like a super vulture. Wait. That's actually really cool. What the hell? Oh. This is really- that's- I like this. What the- It's literally called Fatter Cat. So a chonker becomes a mount. Oh my god, man. They know their player base. Yeah, I know. These are the same kinds of people. Like, these are the people that play the game. That they, they like chonkers. A storm out. Indigo whale. Wait. Um. How are you gonna fly? How? How's the whale fly? Guys, how does the whale fly? Magic? Nah, bro. What? You can't just say everything is because of magic, can you? It's actually in the story. So wait, and this is a this is a mount that you can buy on the store, right? This is a this is a store mount. So you can literally whales can buy whales. No joke. Like no like no shit. This is actually what it is. Oh my god. Wow. Magic carpet. Okay. No, no panda. What? Wait, what? What, bro? Like, what? What, bro? Like, he, he shoots out bananas? And he's got a rainbow circle underneath him? Oh my god. That's grass? Yeah, sure, it's grass. Maybe it's bamboo. Look, look at this. <laughs> this is ridiculous. That's ridiculous, man. What are these? Are they Heelys? God damn, that's badass too. That is cool. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, yeah. That... See, this is, uh... So they literally have, like, a motorcycle. What I like about it is, like, that... Yeah, the, I, I'm not... This is a little bit too weeby for me. I would say so. Uh, $30. Yeah, this shit... Yeah, it's $30. Like, the, these are, like, all storm mounts. So, like, who gives a shit? You know, it's not that big of a deal. And I do want to say... Whenever I finish this video, whenever I finish this video, we're doing a giveaway. We are doing a giveaway for this video. After this video, I mean, uh, this actually looks badass. It's too bad it's a storm mount. I'm not going to buy any fucking storm mounts. 
Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna buy any of that shit. White Devil. <laughs> it's called the White Devil. <laughs> oh shit. Okay, um, what? What the fuck, brother? What? What the fuck, brother? Spriggan Stone? That's really cool. Wow. Oh my god. Look at that. Wow. Jesus. What is this, the Bernstein Bears? And he throws... Oh, to be honest, that is really cool. He throws presents that have, like, that is badass. Okay. Aww. Oh, isn't that, isn't that, isn't that real cute, huh? Isn't that real cute? Oh, that's so cute. This is... Bro, what the fuck? What is this, dude? What is, what is it? What's his face? Oh my god. What is that? That's a Chonkabo. It's a fucking Chonkabo. Look at that. <laughs> it's like, I, I feel like some of these. Yeah, it's a big cock. That's a big old fat cock. It is. Uh, and like, and, and like, wait a minute. So it's like, cause over there, like this game isn't made in America. So like, they're not like offended by everything. So they literally have a fat guy, basically, that you have to make him run around by putting food in front of him. <laughs> Look, cause you have him jump up. He's like, give me that food. I'm hungry. Look at this. Look at this little beefy boy. Look at, oh, give me that cake, please. Please give me that cake. Oh, Look, Look at me. Look. Come on, come on, you can do it. Oh, oh, come on, oh, there's the cake. Wait a minute. So he's only actually flying for the cake. So if you give him a salad, he's not even going to get his wings out. But you got to put out the cake for him, and that's whenever he really goes to work. Damn, that's fucked up. Oh, my God. Look at him. I think their griffins look dumb. I, I don't like the griffins. They remind me of the old gauntlet griffin. A plesiosaur? Oh, what? Holy shit. It's a fly it's a flying Nessie. Holy fuck. It's Lapras. Yeah, exactly. Lapras. Like all all storm mounts. Yeah, yeah, it's unfortunate. But like it, this one is really cool to be fair. This one's definitely really cool. I, I like it. What about the next one? That reminds me of like the Tauralus, the ones from the Necro Lord. Yeah, this is like the Necro Lord ones. Oh, what the hell? Let's talk crafting and gathering. Now, okay. there's a couple mounts that you can just straight up craft, like the flying chair, which is crafted by an alchemist, requires eight clouds breath and one Riviera armchair. How's it They're gonna fly? How's the mount? How's the mount gonna fly? How's the chair gonna fly? How's that happen? Magic, bro, you can't, guys, come on, how's it gonna fly, Look, just, why don't you say like that, that it's got that, oh, there's, there's helium in the cushions or something like that, or like there's actually, like there's miniature, there's like hummingbirds inside of the chair that whenever you sit in the chair, the hummingbirds are like, oh shit, it's time to go to work, and then they fly, right, like what, what, what do you, how do you guys come up with this? It says it's, it's complicated, bro. Yeah, right. Yeah, right, dude. There is the magic bed crafted by a carpenter, which requires three enchanted elm lumber, four undyed velveteen, and four clouds breath. And there is the high bonus, which you get by scoring at least 10,000 points on an ocean fishing trip. Ocean fishing being a new feature that was added Darth, pretty recently. You, then there's thank Sky Builder scripts. So you can collect Sky Builder scripts by crafting items for Ishgard restoration. The oh Pegasus costs 4,200 Sky Builder scripts. It's so also that's... sometimes available to get in Moogle treasure trove events. That actually- The Albino Caracal costs 8,400 Sky Builder scripts. It's the schlatt mount. 
Graffiti costs eight thousand. It's the schlap. It's the schlap mount, man. Sky builders. Events. Look at that. The albino character like costs one. eight thousand four hundred. Sky builders. I, I do. Trips. I like this one. The Ufiti costs eight thousand four hundred. Sky builders. This trips. is Harambe. You have to um. You have to kill a gorilla in order to get that mount. And this is the way it works. You have to. Yeah, you have to kill a gorilla. And the doll mount what is a possible is reward from the Koopa of Fortune minigame in the what firmament. What the hell? There's also the Tirana the dog, hell is which this? requires you to earn 500,000 points towards your Skyward score as every disciple of the hand and land. Oh this my is God. an absolutely monumental achievement, and I it's had a kind camel of given giraffe. up hope on finding anyone that would have this mount that I could record for footage for this video. Wait a but minute. With the help of a friend who speaks some Japanese. I hopped over to the only... Wait, so is this mount... Like, so why is this mount so hard to get? I I is it hard to get because it's like a special, like, ju it's like a jumping puzzle thing? I it's a it's a massive grind. Oh, oh, it's a grind. Okay, never mind. You have to craft forever. It takes nine years to do. Yeah, thank God it's not that cool. Person that I knew had it in the entire world. A person on a JP server... <laughs> And um, they put up with me, uh, allowing me to get a bit of footage of the Pteranodon. So I'm happy to show that footage to you now. That is cool. That's not worth that much time, though. Okay. Okay. Cool. Who's the girl Next the up, Eureka. Eureka is its special okay. set of zones with tough monsters in it and an independent leveling system that was introduced in Stormblood. I'm going to direct you to a Discord for this one as well, which I will drop in the description box below. The Tyrannosaur land. drops in Anemos via Anemos lockboxes. See, this is the same fucking thing that I was talking about with the, with the fucking Drakes, dude. It was the same fucking thing. Because, look... You get to ride on these little, little fucking baby dick raptors. <laughs> you know, but you never get to ride on a Tyrannosaurus. Like, and, and, and d nah, he doesn't fly. Like, there's no way he's gonna fly. Like, I swear to God, if he flies, don't you fucking fly. Animos fates. Don't you fucking fly. The Eldors. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, yeah, he can't? Nah, nah, he can't. How would he fly, man? Look, that was, a, that was actually a really cool mount. I like that. This one is cool, too. I, I really like this mount. Drops from gold bunny chests from Bunny Fates. He's just like the other guy. Pyros. The other absolute The units. Eurekan Petrol drops from gold bunny chests from Bunny Fates in Hydados. And Demi Ozma okay. drops from the final boss of Valdesian Arsenal in Hydados. Dude, that's really and cool. And that is a 56-man raid. It's gonna take. Wait, did they say 56 man raid? Oh, wait, 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 one second. In Hydados. And that is a 56 man raid. It's gonna take a bit of organization and work with other players to get. Next up, airship expedition. Dude, that's badass. It's easy. I bet it probably is. That's fucking cool. Why 56? Because 56 divided by 2 is 53. Which is a prime number. There's only one mount for this because it's kind of a miscellaneous category. You get a zoo what the or hell? one iron voyage spoil at oh, any this resident is like the caretaker other one. in any housing district. Yeah. You get the iron voyage spoil by sending your free company's airship on an expedition okay. to Sector 24. Next, player commendations. If you get 500 commendations from other players, you'll get a gilded Magitek like armor reward. Skin. And the parade chocobo is oh, reward for getting 3,000 player commendations. Oh uh, wait, that wait, the chocobo is actually no way. So they they really just went all the way with this. They said he doesn't even fly for lettuce, but you get a cake out, and this bitch is gonna go all the way to the moon. He's a chonker, yeah. This is Raid my mount. Chocobo. Striker, thanks, for getting 3,000 player commendations. Achievement points is another way to get mounts. You'll need to talk to Jonathas in Gridania near Apkalu Falls to exchange your points for achievement certificates, which okay. you can then exchange for mounts. This is also the NPC you'll need to talk to to get mounts that you've earned from different achievements. Okay. Here are all the mounts you can buy with achievement certificates. Uh, what the hell is this? What is this? 
What is it, a claw machine? You know, if they wanted to make it realistic, they'd have it drop you halfway whenever you're up in the air. Because that's what happens. Like, and, and you know what I mean? Like, you ever had those claw machines back whenever you were a kid? And you'd get, like, the good toy. And, and like, somebody else would fucking do it. And it would, like, go and it would, like, grab it. And it would be like this. You'd see some other kid. They'd be like, it, like, grabs it. It's like, yep, all right. There it is. And you get it. And then somehow, whenever you go to get yours, it's like this. It's like... Uh, just, all right, let me try it. Oh, come on. All right, one more. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, that's another quarter. All right, one more. Come on. Oh, oh, oh. And then sometimes they go, oh, oh, oh. You know what? I've had that happen to me like 50 fucking times at Gotti Town, man. Fucking Gotti Town buffet pizza. They stole my goddamn money. They stole my, they stole my dad's money, to be fair. <laughs> my mom's money. But, it, did you get it in the end? Fuck no, I didn't get it in the end. Hell no, I went to go play Jurassic Park. I'm not gonna waste my money on that shit. Ready, thanks for $100. Appreciate that, man. Thank you very much. It's got G-A-T- It's like, no, got it, Gaddy Town, whatever the fuck you wanna call it. What the fuck? Holy shit. That's uh, nah, man. How's he gonna do that? Nah, bro. How's he gonna? How's he gonna do? How's he gonna do that? Nah, yeah, right, dude. How's he gonna do? That? There's no way. There's no fucking way. He's jacked. This actually does look pretty cool. Like I, I, I like this mount. This is a badass looking mount. Okay. This one is like. I actually like this one. I think this is cool. It's like those mobs in Anor Orlando in Dark Souls 1. They grab your ass. Except without the eye, I obviously. I wanted to show you all of the unobtainable mounts that are no longer available in the game. Okay. But are still pretty nice to look at. Alright, let's see it. There's no way, dude. Imagine them adding fat black chocobo in America. Like, uh, there's no fucking chance that they would add that. Like, literally no fucking chance. <laughs> Wait, it's a BBC. <laughs> Big black chocobo. <laughs> I actually, never mind. I could see Blizzard adding in a BBC. Yeah, I, I could see them doing that. Well, I could see old Blizzard doing that. Nowadays, probably not going to happen. But yeah, this is fucking ridiculous. Oh my god. Jesus. Original fat chocobo. Oh my god. Oh my god, with the cake, dude. Just, da they dangle it right over his face to where, like, probably just a few little crumbs, like, hit his beak and they fall off. That's funny. Flying cumulus. That's actually badass. It's too bad that one's not in the game. Yeah, that is really cool. What the hell is this? What the fuck? That is badass. Okay. Garrow mounts. I like the colors on that. The wings. The fucking wings. That's really cool. Damn. And this has got the- yeah, it's got the wings too. The gold one looks way better. That's really cool. That, that this actually is really, really fucking cool. Like it what's what's crazy for me to see about this is like I would like to see Blizzard look at these mounts and stuff like this. Like obviously, so like Final Fantasy is like So like Blizzard doesn't take enough chances. Final Fantasy, I think, in some cases, takes too many. It's like, what if we had a unicorn? Okay, what if we had a unicorn with lightning on it? Okay, what if we had a unicorn with lightning on it that has, uh, like, little clouds as his feet? 
Well, what if we had a unicorn with lightning with clouds on his feet that also had little strings of lightning coming off of him? Okay, that's good. What if we had a unicorn with a horn on its head that had another horn on top of the horn that it already had on its head? It's like, okay, and with the lightning and the clouds? Yeah, yeah, that too. Okay, what if we had all that, and then on top of that, he has two more wings? It's like, okay, all right, how about that? That's cool. Okay, now what if you give him two more horns, but now he's not a unicorn? Fuck it, we call him a, 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 a triple corn. It's a, it's a tricorn, and it's a three-horned unicorn. And, like, that's what they would do. And so they just take it so far, right? And I wish that Blizzard, a triple corn, yeah, whatever the fuck you want to call it, right? It's a tricorn. Yeah, what I'm saying is, like, the whole idea is, like, it's just, it, it's, like, escalation. You know, escalation, escalation, escalation. And I, th I wish Blizzard would, like, try and, like, take a little bit more chances with their mounts. You know, it's like the long boy, you know? Like, the long boy was out of fucking nowhere. Like, you'd never expect Blizzard to make something like that. Like, a fucking, like, was a brontosaurus? Like, what the hell? But, like, the long boy was one of the coolest mounts because, like, they take chances. They do crazy shit like that. It's awesome. I like it. Whisper go. Thank God that one's not in the game. That's so dumb. That's the dumbest mount I've ever seen in my whole life. This is actually the dumbest one. Do you know what this looks like? This looks like a knockoff version of a McDonald's Happy Meal toy for a ghost, a boo, in Super Mario. This is scuffed. This is, this is the Luigi's Mansion knockoff that didn't even make it to America. That's what it is right there. Okay. Oh, now it's got a little thing on its head. Cool. Very cute. That that animation is cool. Okay, you got yourselves another chonker. There's a lot of these. Players suffer at least 90 days. Oh. Okay, so that's like a that's like an old school flex mount. I see. Wow. Wow. Wee. That's cool. So wait, is this like a is this like a gladiator mount? So yeah, is this like a gladiator mount basically? Like, yeah, it is. Uh, I guess so. Give me one sec. I have to take a piss. I'm back. Sorry about that. Somebody, somebody dropped two hundred fifty dollars for the for the kids. Somebody just dropped two hundred fifty dollars for the kids. Oh my God! Thank you so much, man. Like, I want to say right now, like, I, I'm not trying to set any expectations, but we are actually farther ahead than where we were at last time for our last goal. Like, we are already farther ahead, guys. We, we are popping off. We are absolutely, completely popping off. Keep that in mind. It's going nuts. Did you wash your hands? <laughs> no. We got to do a giveaway for y'all. Yeah, we got to do a giveaway for y'all. This one looks really cool. So these are all, uh, I guess these are like PvP seasonal maps. That's what it seems. Okay. Just different versions of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What the hell? That's really cool. Damn. What the hell, man? That's badass. And it makes sense. See, this one makes sense because it's got like a bunch of robot shit on the bottom. So it's like, oh, it's not magic, it's robot shit. It makes sense. I like that. What the fuck? That is really cool. That That's actually fucking badass. I like, oh my God. He's got li You know what this reminds me of? 
is back in the day, I saw a picture of some guy who had a, um, so he had a, a CPU tower, right? So it's the same as like a computer, but it wasn't an actual computer. And what he had for a case was a taxidermy beaver. And he could push the thing and then part of the beaver would come out and there was a CD-ROM. It was a taxidermy beaver. And this is exactly what I'm thinking about whenever I see that. What the fuck? That's fucking hilarious. That shit was funny, dude. That It was funny like uh, literally fucking 20 years ago. It was a long time ago. It was a real, real long time ago. That's so cool. Yeah, it was funny as hell. This is the first thing it reminds me of. That one's really cool, too. Yeah, I like this. Damn, that actually is nice. Look at that, dude. Look at that, dude. Damn. These are the little PvP mounts. I'm probably never going to get that, but that's still really cool. Thank you, uh, ha. Thank you, thank you, man, for $100. See, this one is actually... I'm actually sad that I didn't get this, bro. Like, this is like a straight-up fucking balling out on another level 1971 Cadillac. This is a 1970... It's coming back? It's coming back next month. Well, maybe I should. That's so cool. That dude, that's so badass, man. Me and the boys driving around. Yeah, that's so cool. Yeah, 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 uh, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. Uh -huh. Guys, yeah, thanks yeah. for watching. I hope yeah, this yeah, video yeah. was helpful yeah, to yeah. you and yeah. has inspired you to yeah, yeah. maybe look into different parts of the game yeah, yeah. that you haven't explored yeah, yeah. before yeah, yeah. to get some of those cool yeah. mounts. If you did find this video helpful, please consider supporting the channel on Patreon or on Twitch. You can also support the channel for free by clicking the subscribe button or by sharing this video with your fellow Warriors of Darkness. Thanks again so That's much for us. watching, and We're I'll see you next time. Bye. All right, yeah, I, I got it. That, that's fucking cool. That's so fucking badass. That's so fucking badass. I like that a lot. That was cool. Yeah, uh, Mods, link that video. Link that video. That's a badass fucking video, number one. That's crazy. Like, shout out to Zeppelin for making that video. That is an insanely awesome video. Uh, I like it a lot.